I sure could use some help. Yeah, hey man, I think this guy needs some help. Yeah, I'll give you a hand. Hey, what's up, internet? You want to put something on the wall, huh? Maybe like a bar, so you can get off the toilet. Huh, that'd be weird. Or perhaps a shelf on the wall, or maybe even a guitar hanger. Anything you want to put on the wall, you're going to need a screw on the wall. So here's what you're going to need. You're going to need a screwdriver, Phillips head, and then you should get some uh, drywall anchors, and, and these easy drywall anchors work well. And you can get them per, uh, different sizes per the weight you're going to be hanging. So you got a 50 pound and a 75 pound. And uh, yeah, and you're going to need a screwdriver. Don't don't eat the screwdriver. Yeah, don't eat it. It'd be bad. And then you can use a bubble level and a tape measure. Not completely necessary, but they are useful. And as an example, we're going to go ahead and put up a guitar hanger. Look at that. First, you're going to want to find a place on the wall, as you probably already actually know where you're going to put your thing. And then you're going to look for studs. Okay, and you kind of knock on the wall and listen for that solid sound. Usually they're about 16 inches apart. And once you find them, you're going to want to go somewhere in between them and mark. Okay, don't, don't mark on the stud. Don't put these things on the stud. It can't happen. Then uh, you want to find a screwdriver. It's about the same thickness as the anchor, as you can see me do there. And you're going to take that screwdriver and then just punch it through uh, the wall where you have your mark, just like that. Now, you can't go through to the other side of the wall, so be careful pun uh, you know, punching the hole. But yeah, once your hole is punched, you go ahead and just put the anchor in like that. Wow. No drill needed. It's much less of a mess. And uh, yeah, so once your anchor is in the wall, go ahead and uh, drive your screw in all the way. This is good practice because uh, once your anchor is actually set into the wall like so, uh, the tip here gets like engaged when you put the screw in all the way. And so that's good. Um, if you're especially not going to have a thing on the wall that already makes the screw go in all the way, if that makes sense, it's good to do that as a pre precursor and okay here's a here's me doing another one uh, it's real time and you can see it's pretty quick actually yeah so there you go I punch the hole and then I'm gonna put in the anchor and uh, because these guitar hangers let the screw go in far enough to engage I don't uh, and this time I'm not gonna put the screw in to let it you know do the tip there of the anchor to engage it but yes you'll see I put it up boom look at that no drill needed People on YouTube are like, hey, get yourself a drill and drill a hole in the wall. No, don't do that. Just punch a hole in the wall. It's real good. Here's another example you can do. Uh, I suggest bigger screws, obviously, but yeah, look at that. There's a shelf, a mock-up. Also, you'd want to put screws on the bottom of that. But uh, anyway, that's how you put a screw in the wall. And yeah, I hope that helped.